Coach Almeida. Bagaimana persiapan Coach untuk menghadapi laga besok melawan Madura United FC? Silahkan. Selamat siang. Uh, this one more uh, game that we know same always difficult games but we have to do our job and 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 make everything to collect the the three points that is our target all right thank you coach uh, pertanyaan yang sama untuk bang jayus haryono bagaimana persiapan bang jayus dan juga teman-teman dari Arema FC dan apa saja motivasi-motivasi Bang Jayus dan juga rekan-rekan pemain lainnya dalam menghadapi laga besok silahkan. Persiapannya seperti biasa Mbak. Ya, kami siapkan di latihan untuk meraih tiga poin itu aja. Baik terima kasih Bang Jayus. Berikut ada pertanyaan for Coach Ameda. There is a question for you from the break, and your team is only has two days to prepare the before the match begin. Is that enough for you and your team? Of course, it's a very it's a very short time. We was we was thinking in have one more day at least, but okay, we have to to we know is is uh, this situation is is because all the pandemic and all all these things, so we have to accept. Uh, of course, for the preparation, uh, is everything is about tactical and and recover the players for make sure they can play ninety uh, minutes or maximum time possible in the next game because the time of recover is around seventy two hours is almost impossible to recover a hundred percent the players. All right, thank you, coach. Another question from Abu from wearemania.net. Coach, how did you analyze about Madura United with their new coach Fabio Lefundes? And you won four and one draw when against coaches from South America. Will you make coach Fabio be next victim to be beaten tomorrow match? No. What what we gonna do is of course the team improve when the coach come. We know is a team who is playing good and we know is a hard game, but we have to do our job. To win the game and and make the the three points about this fight against the Latin coach or European coach. This is not my what I have. What I'm gonna do is play against Madura, not play against uh, the coaches. So I'm just focusing and collect the the three points and not worried if I win or uh, not because they are from other country or whatever. It's not no make any sense. All right, thank you, coach. Another question. How to keep the focus of the players so uh, you and your team could uh, stay in the first position and win this uh, Liga in Indonesia? No, oh, the motivation has to be there. Uh, Arema, a long time, never was in this position. So now we are in this position in the first. Uh, we want, all want to be there and we want all to arrive in the end in first position. So I think that is more enough. We be motivation. We are nine games for a dream, for a, a chance to, to to win the league. So I think uh, it's impossible. You have better motivation that uh, you are in the top and game by game, you know, you are more near uh, the, the championship, the league. All right. Thank you, Coach. Uh, pertanyaan selanjutnya untuk Bang Jayus dari Agungwi Aremania.net. Bang Jayus, Madura United juga punya kiper asing. Apa yang kamu ketahui tentang itu dan bagaimana besok jika uh, dia main dan motivasi apa yang uh, Bang Jayus punya untuk menjebol gawang dari Madura United? Silahkan. Oh. Kalau masalah kiper Madura ya bagus itu Mbak. Tapi kami berusaha untuk menjebol gawang Madura. Udah itu aja. Pertanyaan lagi untuk untuk Bang Jayus. Uh, ya. Bang Jayus, pada laga besok Arema main tanpa Rensi. Bagaimana menurut Bang Jayus? Dan seberapa besar peran Rensi di lapangan menurut Bang Jayus? Silahkan. Kalau masalah tanpa Rensi, 
kan nanti kan ada pelapisnya mbak Sem- 